Holy shit, dude, we did it. Ah, oh, I'm so happy right now. <laughs> we did it. We freaking did it. Okay. Peril, E51, yes. This is what it looks like. What's going on, Ms. Johnny, and welcome back to Fallout 3. This is the campaign, baby. We can be back in, and this is episode number 10. Today, we're doing the T-51. We're going straight for the keys, okay? So right now, we're in minefield. Go ahead and go to this mine. Mm-hmm. Uh, we're gonna get this, these, uh, these mines real quick. We're gonna head through minefield, and then we're gonna run over to the Dave's Republic, because Dave has one of the keys we need to get into the vault. In Fort Constantine, um, if you don't know what I'm, what I'm talking about, uh, Fort Constantine, there's three doors. Each door needs a key. If you don't have the key, you can't open it. It's inaccessible. So, we have to get the keys, then travel to Fort Constantine, and then, um, we will have the T-51. Now, last episode, we got the training, so I think this episode, we'll do what we gotta do to try to get the T-51 as fast as we can. Uh... And that's what we're doing. So here we go. But so let's go ahead and travel straight there. We got lots to do this episode, so I'm gonna try to do as much as I can, as fast as I can. Um, even if it means I gotta kill a bunch of people to get the key, whatever. That's what I'm gonna do. So here we go. <clears throat> also, if you guys are new, make sure you guys do the YouTube thing, like comment, subscribe, and show your friends. This is uh one of my favorite games of all time, and we do play a lot of games here. So if you guys do like. What's happening here? I get shot in my head? I'm crippled in my face, apparently. Um, so if you guys do like Let's Plays, walkthroughs of games, older games, new games, etc. What are you doing to me? Why do you gotta be a jerk all the time? Yeah, I see you. The Roach King? Well, you're gonna die. Once I can get this. You did that to yourself. I was just walking through stuff, to be honest. And then look at you. You being a jerk all the time. All right, we're gonna take that uh, mini gun. We're taking this. We're stealing all this shit. I don't care. Ooh, mini nuke. That's one. So you're telling me you live here? This man lives right here. Why would you even do that? You can't go find like a town or something. Crazy to me. All right, we gotta go to status. Limbs. Let's go ahead and uncripple my face so I don't freaking do this blurry nonsense. All right, let's just continue on. I guess apparently we uh, that guy just lives literally right there on a a pile of trash, which is you know more power to people. I'm not gonna sit here and judge. No judgment over here on this side. Like I said, I'm just gonna book it straight there. I might cut until we get there, but it's, it's pretty empty. I always remember this game to be pretty. Uh, how would you say it? cluttered, but I guess it's not. I know Fallout 4 is very cluttered. There's like 300 locations in Fallout 4. And once you get in the city, there's like fucking so many. So. Fucking like a Brahmin. There's a random Brahmin in the middle of the freaking wasteland. I'm not gonna deal with that rad scorpion at the moment. I wanna get straight to this place, man. Straight to it. Hope you guys are doing well. Hope you guys are staying safe. Using the masks if you gotta use masks. All the whole thing. Uh, what's up here? Nothing. I don't think so. We're we're not gonna go up there anyway. But always take a mental note and go up there later. But I don't think there's anything up there. I do know there's actually a a, 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 a city, a town, on one of these. I think it's called Arfu or something like that, or something crazy. I can't remember. I really hope I'm going the right way. Really, really hope I am. Because it's been a minute since I've been a place like this. Go ahead and grab this stuff. I like right around here. Yep. Quantum. There's a lot of quantums in this world. We gotta get more bobby pins. Like one thing we're kind of lacking at the moment. We got like 14 of them. 
What's what's this place? Hmm. This is definitely a raider place. We're not gonna go to that right at the moment. I don't feel like dealing with people at the moment. I just really want to get this done as fast as we can. We're already, like, we're already almost 10 minutes in. I think it's in this little corner somewhere, but I'm not for sure. It's like a... It's like a... I think it's, I think it's this gated place up here, but I'm not for sure. No, it's not definitely not this place. Is there more people up here? Raider. I'm just hoping we don't go into... You know, see those people that are like, that take a lot of health. Let's save it. Let's just freaking deal with these guys. There's three of them down. Four. Where's this guy going? I see you, dude. Oh, you're gonna just run away. You're a raider, dude. You're supposed to be scary. But you aren't. You just isn't scary, dude. Figure your shit out. Literally just figure it out. Uh, nothing too crazy on that guy. Nothing. Nothing. Can we get inside here? Sub a power substation. Don't think there's anything in here. No. I can always come back to this. I really just want to get this done. So continue on. I didn't really take long. We kind of destroyed them all pretty quickly, to be honest. I think it's right up here. Yes, I'm pretty sure. Republic of Dave. This is this is a pretty creepy area, and you'll you'll find out here soon. Once I get there. Yeah, right here, right here, right here. Oh man, <laughs> uh, I don't, I don't want to kill anybody to get the keys, but I think we're going to have to kill a lot of people to get the keys. Hey, you! Stop! What do you want from the Republic of Dave? I'm not here to hurt anyone. What is this place? Uh, your Republic is a forfeit per to be declaimed, reclaimed by the wasteland. What is this place? This is the Republic of Dave. Duh! It's named for President Daddy. But you have to talk to him if you want to stay here. I think I'd like to. I think I'd like to meet Dave. Okay, I'll take you. But President Daddy doesn't always like new people. Okay, follow me. You got it. Now, this is why it's so creepy. It's kids. There's like, I don't know, ten kids or something like that, and then there's one dude, one guy. I always found that super creepy, weird. Oh, that's Jessica. Awful today. Excuse me, dude. Hey, this is we Dave. Have... I am Dave, President of the Republic of Dave. You will address me as Mr. President, or I will have you executed. Shut up. Now, are you applying for a citizenship, asylum, or just vacationing in the Republic of Dave? I need your freaking key. Most exalted President Dave, I am the ambassador. You are? Excellent. It's good to see that the Wasteland has finally recognized the Sovereign Republic of Dave. If the people of the Wasteland are generous and respectful, I might deign to annex them. Um... I need your key. How do I get your key without killing you? Is the problem I'm having. Anything happening in this place, Mr. President? There's an election for the next president. Don't look so surprised. Can't you see this is a republic? I'd say it looks more like a dictatorship, but we wouldn't know. I just got here. Yes, absolutely. I don't know. Ah, a seeker of knowledge, then. Well, trust me, an election is what separates a president like myself from a monarch like my father. Okay, your father was a monarch? How much radiation have you been exposed to? Not the butterfly, you moron. I meant the kind of leader that holds his office for a life. My father inherited his political power from birth and renamed this great nation the Kingdom of Tom. 
Although I also inherited my political power from my father when I took over, I formed a republic so the people may... How much radiation did you get? Is the real fucking question. Can I help with the lecture, Mr. President? All right, sure. Why not? The people have a tendency to wait until the last minute to vote, but I'd like just to get it over with. I'll spare a few caps if you just tell each of the adults to get over to the voting booth sometime today so I cinch the victory. Not that I have anything to worry about. The people know who their leader is in this republic. Okay. How'd they go now? I'm pretty sure if I talk to everybody... Dave says you're okay? Fine. Uh... You should go vote if you haven't already. I guess you're right. I'll go right now. Cool. And then... I, th I, I There actually might... I, yeah, there actually I is... I heard that Dave allowed you to stay. Well, welcome, stranger. Just be mindful of the children. Um, yeah, you should go vote. You're right. So, actually, I always think there's a lot more... Or a lot less adults luck, here. There Dave. actually is you have my a few vote. adults. So I take that back. But I did always think this, was, this place was very creepy for whatever reason. Even whenever I was a, a child. Uh, let's go ahead and wait. So way it's morning. Three, six, perfect. Museum of Dave. That's really weird. Perfect. Perception bobblehead. That's what I'm talking about. Alright, we got it here. We are probably shouldn't be in here. Yes. Hey there. Are you gonna play Republic with us? Uh Dave's men's quarters. Bob. Can I talk to you, Bob? Can't talk to Bob, huh? You're almost as big as Dave. Alright, well. Go talk to this Dave dude again. I did my best. I did what I had to do. Don't even think of Shut up. out with it, Ambassador. This Republic isn't going to. Uh. Did you already vote, Mr. President? Of course I voted. I was the. F Man, I think we're just. I think we might just kill him. I want to get his key. I don't want to freaking have to do a bunch of dumb shit or like pickpocket him or anything. So, plus it'll give us more stuff. Ooh, we might have to be doing this. Fuck it, communist. Breaking into that. I get that. <sighs> We're just doing it. I know you guys. You guys are gonna have to die. Alright, I don't want to do this, but I just really want to get this key and get it out of here. Um, look at this flame yeah, Okay. Yep. Isn't there one more? Or am I dumb? Okay, well. I did what I had to do. Special key. Bada bing. Uh, melee. Now, I don't want to kill anybody to do this, but... I don't, I don't, can you kill kids in this? I don't know if you can or not. I don't think you can in Bethesda games. Yeah, I think she, like, they got pretty much infinite health. That's alright, though. Oh. You're on fire, Bob. I was talking to you earlier. But you just didn't, you were just sound asleep. Sound of freaking sleep. We'll just steal all their shit, too. I'm not trying to be a nice guy or a bad guy, I'm just playing the game. I just want to get certain things and then call it a freaking day. Uh, Chinese officer sword. Just make sure we can't grab anything while we're here, you know. Empty. 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 Oh. Ruined. Auto cap. Let's go. Auto box. I'm not gonna hurt you, kids. Just wanna take all of your stuff and then leave. Let's 
Cigarettes. Nothing, nothing. Nothing. Okay. I think we're good. Alright, now we gotta go to Rivet City. And we gotta get this other one from... Not fast travel when there's enemies. I forgot there's freaking kids that want to kill me. Uh, there shouldn't be any more now. We should be good. Rivet City. We gotta go talk to... Oh man, I don't remember what his name is. <clears throat> I might cut it when we get there. Because I have to literally run through this entire thing and find him, so... Give me a second here. If, I, if, I, if, I'm, if I'm not mistaken, I think he's in the stairwell, and then you have to go this way. Or maybe I'm, maybe I'm mistaken. Want to do some buff out? Maybe a little psycho. Oh my god, dude! Are you freaking serious? He's a junkie. You want to do some buff out or some psycho? <laughs> oh my god, dude! Get your shit together. Hey there. <clears throat> okay, we gotta go <clears throat> to the common room. Um, is this the common room? It is the common room. I knew I was in the right place. Now, if we s let's just wait five hours and see if he comes in. I'm hoping he'll uh. Oh. Yep, there he is. Ted Skull. Strayer. You can chill with me if you want, dude. Um... Does, do, do you actually do anything here in the Rivet City? You mean... Like, fix stuff? Nah. I just hang out, dude. I've got enough chems to last a while. Oh, yeah. See you later, later. Ted. Whoa. What? So I think what we're gonna do, we didn't even go and get the key just yet. We got Dave's key, which we had to kill him, but I don't want to kill anybody in the Rivet City because that's gonna make things a lot difficult for us. Because the entirety of, of, uh, of Rivet City is gonna try to kill us. So I think if we go in here... I think we can go in this... And then follow this entire metro out. And then it should lead us up to Museum of History. And then we can go to the Ninth Circle. And then, hopefully, we can start the actual mission to um, do this. So, let's go ahead and kill all these raiders. Come on. There we go. We need... Stim packs. We also need a light. It is so dark in here. Like, super dark. I don't want the pistol. Dang it. Alright, let's loot these dudes. This is gonna be a pretty long episode, because I think we're just gonna go until we get the... the stuff. If not, we'll have to do it in two episodes, because there's a lot to do we gotta do. A lot to do to, to get the uh, armor, so... Words. Okay, this, that, I don't want that. What, I can pick that up. Go ahead and read this. Our combat armor is not very good. We'll, we we'll wear this raider outfit for right now, but... Not gonna be ideal, let's put it that way. Northbound to Museum Station. Museum of Technology, Museum of American History, right here. Yeah, so, I'm actually going the right way. Museum station this way. Pretty sure. <laughs> I mean, the sign wouldn't lie to me, right? That would make a lot more sense. Okay. Oh my god, you scared the shit out of me. Hey, would you die? Hey, you're on fire. That's gotta hurt. Honestly. That can't be a good time. To be honest with you, can't be a good time. We sleep, sleep it off for one hour, get our health back instead of using a stim pack. Um. Also, I want to apologize if if I did cut some things. I, I'm just trying to figure everything out. Uh, Northbound Museum of 
station is this way. I think we actually gotta go this way. And I'm gonna run through this entire thing. Just like so. Kill this douchebag. Go ahead and loot her. That's like the easiest way that I can remember. You got a rivet city, then there's a, a thing right across, and then you can go through that, and you just follow this metro, metro station into um, the mall, which is what the north side of it is or whatever. And that'll let, uh, allow us to actually start the mission. You gotta shoot him in the head. We gotta go to ninth circle and talk to Crowley, if I do remember right. God dang it. Why are we freaking breaking all my shit? There we go. Uh, nothing else in here. Oh! Ouch! Ouch! Stop it, please! Stop! Really making this a difficult task for this guy. Okay. This guy being me. Shit hurts. Okay, don't do that. All right. South by. Oh man, is it that way or this way? Let's say museum tech. Okay, perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Now we should be able to just walk out of here, and it should should be right next to where we got to be at. Actually, oh, it isn't. Oh, we need to wait. Hey, quit throwing grenades at me! Oh my God, it's a brute. It's a brute. It's super dark, I, I know. I, I can't wait until I kill these guys, so you're gonna just give me a second. Oh my god, there's just things- so many super mutants here. Out. Come on. A lot of brutes here. A lot of them. Ow, ow, ow. Yeah, no, I hear you, I hear you. Impact. So many freaking super mutants. Alright, we gotta get this minigun out. I know you guys probably can't see anything. I can barely see anything. I can't wait because there's enemies, so I'm gonna just deal with it for just one moment here. Come on, eat those. He's eating them. We have a lot of ammo for this, so we're just gonna let it rip. We're down here. The condition's really bad, so it's really making it difficult for us to shoot. Oh my god, I just really want to get to this place, man. That's all I'm trying to do. It should be right over here to the right. I'm thinking we can just go straight there. And then we'll be okay. Should be like right here. Oh. Hey, stop it, please. Yep, right here. Perfect. Like I said, super dark. I apologize. <laughs> okay. Okay, now we're inside. Perfect. Now we can just wait it out until it's morning. Uh, actually, we can just go straight in here. Go ahead and talk to everybody in here real quick. I want to talk to Crowley, especially. <clears throat> hey. Why is everybody running away from me? Hello. Oh, yeah. oh why, hello there. Wait, you're not going to tell me how rare it is to see a human in the underworld? Nice to meet you, Quinn. Oh, God, I'm out of here. Nice to meet you, Quinn. You too, stranger. I know a lot of people around here don't take kindly to humans wandering around. But I've met a lot of your people in my travels. Is the Lincoln Memorial around here somewhere? Yeah, just east of here. Bunch of guys with guns are holed up there. Okay, time for me to go. We can also get the uh, Lincoln Repeater, which would really help us out a lot too. Uh, we gotta find Crowley. This is a chop shop. Could be a chop shop still. We need to find Crowley. I think he's up. 
Oh, well, would you look Winthrop. at that? We got us a smooth skin visitor. Oh, we. We ain't seen one of your type in a long time. Jesus Christ, what are you, smooth skin? What does that mean? Smooth skin? You know, because your skin is so smooth and tasty. Relax, <laughs> I'm just kidding. But I had you going, didn't I? Uh, where am I? You're in Underworld, smooth skin. It's the only safe place for we ghouls in D.C. We're here out of sight and out of mind. The mutants leave us alone, and the slavers usually don't come this far into the city, so it's not bad. Really, the Brotherhood of Steel is the only thing we have to worry about. So long as we don't leave Underworld, that is. What's your beef with them? Bastards. They don't seem to be able to tell us apart from the super mutants. Or maybe they just don't care. They see us and shoot on sight. At least they have the common courtesy to miss most of the time. Still, bigots. City full of ghouls, huh? Ghouls. That's right. As long as you don't bother us, we won't bother you. Feel free to come and go, trade, sleep, whatever. Just make sure that you leave whatever trouble is following you at the door. Because we don't want it. So enjoy your stay, smooth skin. Okay. I want to have a look around. Enjoy your stay. Just try and keep from shooting up the place. We got a nice little deal going on down here. We'd like to keep <clears> it nice. Can you repair my thing? Can you pay me? Then I can repair your stuff. Alright, we gotta get our... Combat armor up. Because ours is not doing very well. Alright, let's go. Let's go up to the ninth circle up here. And we gotta talk to... Freaking what's her face. Snowflake. Patchwork. Ninth circle. Crowley, right here. Mr. Crowley. What are you looking at? You'd think you'd never seen a ghoul up close before. Got nothing against ghouls. No, I have a say. Does that hurt me? Or say, does that hurt? Hey, I'm just looking to trade a drink for some gossip. Fucking brain eater. Easy now. I've got, so I've got nothing against ghouls. Is that so? Even if I call you a milk-sucking, mutant-loving, water-stealing son of a whore. Grave-loving zombie? All true except for the part about the mutants, the water and the whore. You know, I don't need to stay here and listen to your lame insult. Now, if I... I can't remember. If I say something bad, I think he doesn't give me the thing. Another human bigot. Yes, okay, yeah, yeah. So we can't, we can't say anything crazy, so... What are you looking at? We can at? talk to him. Yeah. I got nothing against ghouls. Uh, all true except ex okay. okay <laughs> I there like we go. a human that knows this place. Too many of you think we're all just zombies. They don't know or don't care that we're just as human as they are inside. We bleed, we hurt, we regret. And you know what really pisses me off? They think the only way to kill us is to shoot us in the head. Like in the old zombie stories, and that'll put us out of our misery. Hey, I know. Maybe you could help me even the score. Oh, uh, what's the plan? Not everyone is as sympathetic to ghouls as you are. In fact, some humans are downright bigots. They treat us like zombies, calling us brain eaters and shufflers. Well, I'm gonna make them pay. Uh, before I get into the details, you don't have anything against killing, do you? Day isn't complete until I've killed something. Well, aren't you the bloodthirsty type? I got this list of people. Ghoul bigots. Real scum. I've only got four guys left on the list. Started out with eleven. All of them hate ghouls and treat us like we're zombies. They all deserve to die. But it has to be done with a headshot. Just like the old stories, where zombies can only be killed that way. I'll pay you a hundred caps for each one. 25 if they die some other way. Um. Sir, people like that don't deserve to live. Excellent. Take this sniper rifle. You'll need it. Here's a list of the guys and their last known locations. Word will get around if Tenpenny's killed, but I'll need proof for the others. Bring me back something personal from each of them as proof. Like a key, a ring or something. Here's Dave's key. He's dead, but not from the shot of the head. Um, Dave is kind of, well, he's dead. Goodbye. 
Okay, now that, now that we have this mission, <clears throat> it should make it a little bit easier to get the key from uh, the dude Rivet City. And that's the only reason uh, we did this. So I'm hoping if we get out of here now, uh, let's go ahead and go ahead and wait. <clears throat> the reason why I couldn't I couldn't bad bad mouth him uh, the crawling up stairs because if I did that then he wouldn't give me the mission. So I'm hoping I'm hoping I'm hoping if we go this way and we go back to Rivet City, it'll allow us to actually have uh, speech things to like let us. I need to get these freaking super mutants. Oh my god. Let me see here. I need to get a sniper rifle or something that I can kill this guy over here with. Missed. Man, this freaking thing is not a good time. I'm just gonna walk up to him, I think. It'd be a lot easier than freaking sniping him. Sniping in this game is horrendous. There we go. Now we should be able to just do this now. World map. I can't freaking do this. Rivet City, yes. And then we'll go all the way over, talk to this Ted guy. And hopefully it'll allow us to have different speech things and we can actually just get the key off of him. I'm hoping. I don't want to kill him, because if I kill him, then that means we have to freaking deal with everybody in Rivet City. And that's not something I'm trying to do. Because then we couldn't ever come back here, really, so... Hey there. Going here. I'm hoping. He's still here. Ted Strayer. You can chill. Uh... He's still... I still can't talk to him? Hmm. How the fuck am I supposed to get this key off of him? You mean... I... You know Mr. Crowley, yes! Whoa, that's a blast from the past. My dad knew a dude named Crowley. I never met him, though. I think dad said he died when they were checking out some old fort. Okay, here we go, here we go. Uh, do you know what they were doing in that fort? Can you think of any reason he might want you dead? I'm here to kill you and there's nothing you can do about it. I learned what I came for, thank you. Um, do you know what they were doing at the fort? Nah. He said that old man Tenpenny hired him and some other guys to go in there, but he never said why. My dad made enough caps off it to set him up good, though. What do you know about Tenpenny? Can you think of any reason he might want you dead? No shit. That dude wants me dead? If you give me something personal as a proof, I'll let a lot of Crowley. Whoa. Is this, like, worth caps? Cause I got needs, man. Uh, speech 100%. Uh, sure, Let's dude. Let's go. I don't know what it's for anyway. Don't need to get all thug-like. Perfect. Got a special key. Now we're freaking. now we're cooking with fire, baby. <clears throat> See, if I would've killed him, the entirety of Rivet City, uh, security would've came after me, and the residents, and I just don't want to deal with that. Then we would've never been able to come back here and trade and do those things, so... It, there's like a workaround. Okay, now we got that. We need to get Dave's special key, which is right here. Dukov's place. Not Dave's. Dukov's key. Right here. We kill him, it's whatever, but we really just need to get him, so. Where is the guy? The upstairs? I didn't kill him, I don't think. What you need? How about a Okay, um, care to comment? He's fucking dead, that's what I can tell you. He's not, because I just Feral talked to him. ghouls ripped his nuts off and ate them for dinner. Where did he die? Curly's alive and he paid me to kill you because he hates ghouls. I'm going to put a bullet right between your eyes. I don't think I need it here anymore. Where did he die? Uh, a little shithole called Fort Constantine. It fucked us up, but good. Where is this Fort Constantine? It's northwest of here, numbnuts. A long fucking walk, too. Wankers like you can't get in, though. Okay, I need a special set of keys. Actually, Crowley is alive. I'm supposed to kill you and bring so him through. So, the meat bag is alive, huh? And I bet I know what he wants. 
but I don't know what you want. What's your angle, clown shoes? Uh, give me something I can use proof. Here's 200 cats. Give me something to prove I killed you. I don't think I need it here anymore. God, I really want to freaking be able to... Let's failed go. it. Dang it. Here's 200 cats. Give me something. Now, you don't even know what's going on. Now take it and get the hell out of here. Perfect. Alright. We're gonna get rid of 200 you caps. your goddamn key. You okay, we got our key. Now we can go straight to Fort Constantine. Which, oh my god. Alright, we gotta go all the way... Let's remove this marker. We gotta go all the way... ...up here. We got a long haul. Let's put it that way. Why is there... Why is there freaking people in here? What the f... What did I just go and get into? Oh, we gotta get out of here. Uh, do I have any... Mines? Yes. Oh my god, I killed myself. We gotta go. Am I going this way? Sure. Oh my gosh. Freaking spawned in a super mutant place. I must have killed somebody with that, that landmine I put down. Oh, what's over there? You see that? I don't remember that place at all. Just continue on. I might cut here. I don't really want to. I don't want this this video to be too long. Um, because right now we're at 50 minutes, and well, I mean, I guess I, I, did, I probably did cut it a little bit here and here and there, so we should be fine. Here, eat this freaking mine, will ya? <laughs> ah, what is this? Wait, is this that spring place? I think there's slaves here we can, uh... What you call it? Um, am I... am I hurt by chance? I'm actually not too bad. I thought I was, like, crippled or something. I went ahead and cut all that out. We had to go all the way around, uh, Paradise Falls there. We'll come back to that eventually. Uh, I'm not trying to make this... this episode too long. Especially when I'm just walking in the middle of the wasteland. I think that'd be kinda... Kinda good. What do you want? Here, eat. Have that. Can you... can you... come over here? You come over here, please come over here. This way. This way, please. Yeah, 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 you're doing good. Keep coming. Did you not hit that? Really? You don't hit those? Well, that's freaking not a, not cool. Uh, laser rifle. Mr. Gutsy. Pretty close. Let's go. Wait, I need to go ahead and loot him. Yeah, he usually gives flamer fuel and things like that. Alright. Keep on trucking. What is this, a spider? Oh, it's an ant. I don't, think any, I don't think there is spiders in this game. Perfect. I don't need ant meat, so we can just keep it chugging, lugging, lugging on, man. I don't know why I said that. That was super cringy. Come on. So close. Well, actually, how close are we? I'm not doing too bad. Just gotta keep pushing. One last little push through here. Through the wasteland. Oh my god, where are the squad scorpion? E e today is the day for you to die, huh? You just said, you know what? It's like going sideways through that, do you see that? Oh my god, we're so close, but yet so far away yet. What is, this, what is this tent up here? Definitely gonna be checking this out real quick as well. Come on, come on, come on. I wish I could just run, man. It'd make this so much easier. I keep saying that, but fuck. Abandoned tent. Now I'll take all your freaking... I'll take your stuff. There's actually a book there, too. Nikola Tesla. 
Uh, yes, please. Empty. Nothing too crazy. It's in the locker. Rounds. Let's go ahead and sleep for an hour to get our health back and our cripples. Quantum. Anything in these boxes? Okay. I think we're good. Perfect. Plus, it'll give us an, uh, a place to, to come back at, too, so... What's over here? What's going on? Someone's shooting over here. See? Okay, it's just one of those things. I'm just gonna bypass them. God dang it. Why is there, there was a freaking army of rad scorpions here, or what? Come on. Perfect. Why is there so many of those? I'm not even gonna deal with them. I'm just gonna keep it rocking. A Yagwai. Fuck. Fuck. Oh my god, that was freaking clutch. Holy shoot, man. Those Yaguais, they don't mess around. What's over here? What are you guys doing out here? Brotherhood outcast? Let me talk to you. Hey, quit running from me, jack wagon. Hey, can I talk to you? Why don't you go bother the outcast, huh? I'm taking all your freaking ammo. We got a shish kebab. Nice. Can we make one of those? Oh man, we don't have, we don't have anything we, we need for that. You know, like lawnmower blades and things like that yet, so... That's cool. Hey, Brotherhood, can you guys handle that? I'm gonna go uh, up here and get your armor that's the best in the game, so... If you're cool with it, then... I'm just gonna keep it rocking up this freaking mountain. Pun intended. Pun intended words. Okay. Now, it's just like a little hut-looking place. It's like down here, I guess, huh? It's like down there, I think. Why is there robots? Oh, this guy's just gonna take all of that, huh? He didn't care about nothing. Uh, okay. Come here, dude. You stuck? Here, just eat all these if you can. Perfect. Personal offices. We gotta get down. Can't go that way. We should be able to just scale this mountain, I'd say, but I don't know. Just be safe, because this game is crazy with fall damage. Uh, we'll just scale it down this way. Perfect. We're not there yet. I think it's over here. Yeah, we're like on it. It's not this place though, I don't think. No. I need to go around. Are we like, are we stuck in here now? Can I get like through here? Oh, hell yeah. <clears throat> it's this little place right here, actually. Who's shooting at me? Oh, I didn't even see you. Let's go. Alright. Hey. Nothing. Alright, here we go guys. This is Fort Constantine right here. This little tiny little area. Does it look like much? But you guys are gonna see. Okay. You gotta kill this guy here. Okay, let's just make sure we can't grab anything. There's some guns and bullets. Let's turn on this light so we can actually see stuff. Nothing there. Go ahead and loot this dude. Okay. Go the Kappa Wasteland. Now we gotta keep going down. Wastelander. 
Bobby pins, bottle caps, Chinese armor. We're just gonna take all of this. We'll sell a bunch of stuff if we have to. There's caps everywhere, so why not? Bobblehead, let's get it. Taking all of this. Bottle caps for days, bro. Four Constantine launch codes. Well, I don't know what we're going to do with launch codes, but we're taking it. Okay, we're taking it to the bank. Alright, this is what we got to use. Use key. That uses Ted's key. And then we can open this door. And that's how you get in here. If you don't have it, I don't think you can get in here. I think it's like inaccessible or something. Alright, open this gate. We can continue looting here. We gotta need all this ammo. God dang it. I want, I want this I want these caps. Come on. Auto cap. Vision batteries. Okay, we came from here. We need to go this way. <clears throat> this door. Okay. Don't mind me. Do not mind me. <clears throat> I am just... <clears throat> just trying to figure everything out, alright? These bottle caps. Yes. Good locker. Cigarettes. For sure. We are crippled in the face. Let's go ahead and stem pack it up. Alright. You push me. You actually got to go down. But I just really want to make sure we can't grab anything in here while we can. I don't feel like coming back, so. Stim pack. Nope. Take the one we just used on our head, so. Not too bad. Alright. Head down again. Alright, terminal. You are about to be introduced to the I see you, yeah. Go ahead, Mr. Gutsy. You're not gonna do anything? Oh, you're gonna fucking put me in fire, huh? This guy just eats. These Mr. Gutsies don't mess around. Come on. Empty, I don't even know why I opened it. Big book of science, we'll take that. We actually got a few freaking uh, books in this place. This place is kind of like loaded, to be honest. They must have like, they're just like, this place right here? Yeah, definitely worth it. Not clear though, I can tell you, because I'm still in here. He's gonna keep going down, like that's really what we gotta do. Keep opening empty freaking places. We go. I don't think I uh, looted that Mr. Gutsy. Is whatever, I guess. Candy Boy Apples. We gotta freaking. We gotta freaking read some of these. Big Book of Science. Guns and Bullets. Stim Pack. And we're also gonna save it. We haven't been in here. Make sure we can't do anything else. Oh, there's a radi radiation in here, huh? I'm trying to be as fast as I can, but it is what it is. God, this place is actually like big. I don't remember this being this big. Turn that off. I don't want to listen to it. Keep opening empty shit. Stop it. Darts. We're gonna use a dart gun eventually, once we get the schematics for it. Okay, wait. This is actually openable. Part of cigarettes, hell yeah. Wait, what's up here? Stem gauge, stem gauge assembly. Oh my god, I'm over numbered man. Put that on. No, no, no. I want that back. I'm gonna put this in there, and this is what we're gonna do. Put apparel, put that on, put that on. Carton cigarettes. 
Am I still freaking... Really? A miss. Hmm. Here, take that. Don't want him. Always get those later. Use key. That use Dukov's key. We still have one more key to run through yet, so... We're getting close. That warhead storage key. Use key. That's Dave's. Let's go, over, let's go over here and loot any of this stuff over here if we can. I don't need any of this nonsense, actually. Looks like this is my lucky These miss are gutsy, dude. Oh my god. Yeah, I see with the freaking flamethrower. Not today. One more. Two more. There we go. I want your scrap metal. What's this way? Where does this go? Warhead storage. Hostile. Target identified. Perfect. Okay. We can get some nice stuff out of here, you know, why not? Here we go. Wood chipper? Okay, relax, will ya? Scrap metal. We're actually getting a lot of scrap metal. We gotta head to Megaton and uh, sell that stuff. There's nothing else in here? Ow, ow, ow! Those things, they hurt. I'm not even gonna deal with those until we get the armor. Alright, let's run down here and grab it. I'm kinda of prolonging this, I know. Even though I said I wanna make this as fast as I can. Very hard? Come on now. Okay, open the door. Here we go. Here it is. Oh my goodness. Holy shit, dude. We did it. Ah, I'm so happy right now. Alright, we got a fat man here. We're gonna take that. We also got another book. DC Journal of Medicine, I think is what that was. Yes, or internal medicine. Whatever the fuck it was. I don't even know. Okay, let's go ahead and eat these pork and beans. Instant mash. Alright, let's go to this armor and R&D terminal. Stable stasis fields. <laughs> we did it! We freaking did it! Okay. Peril, E51, yes. Oh my god. I can't believe we did it. Oh my jeez. Alright, we can drop this, drop that, drop that. We have so much stuff, dude. We gotta get rid of some of this stuff. I thought this increased our weight. I guess it doesn't. That fat man was extremely freaking heavy. We had two of them. Pistols. Uh, repair. No. There we go. We could probably get rid of a couple of these. Actually, I want to, I want one of those. Put that there. You go. Okay, we got it. This is what it looks like. Kind of slow with this. I don't know why it's going so slow, but that's what we look like now. And literally, we we we're pretty much invincible now. Pretty much. Like I don't think there's a condition on this, so we're literally just gonna freaking run through shit. Literally. See what we have uh what is that? We're almost full health. There's a thing out here that we gotta kill yet. Two seconds here, let me uh do like this. Look, our health barely went down at all there. So we can just we just eat shit. Come on. These sentry bots are no joke. Come on. You are. Well, you're not going to get me anytime soon, my dude, because guess what? I got the T-51, baby. We freaking out here. We're living our best life. 
To be honest with you. What is this? Bomb storage? Bomb storage? <laughs> uh, what? There's bombs? I got, I got shot in my head again, I guess. I can't see anything. It's all blur- Dude, it is so dark in here. I keep forgetting there's fell out. Wait, how do I get out of here? Here we go, here we go. I didn't even see this. I'm assuming we gotta go... Warhead? I don't know. Put me back in here. Okay, so it just leads you around, I guess? Oh, and these are the bombs. Oh, I didn't see those. Holy shoot, man. That's a lot of bombs. Okay, cool. Yeah, let's just get out of here before we freaking die. Wait, I got a question. I gotta, I gotta test this out for science. For science. Dum -da -da -dum -da -dum. Oh, mini nuke. Nice. This place is just loaded with stuff. Okay. Let's save it. I think you guys can tell what we're about to do. Oh, I don't think they- will they explode, I wonder? I guess not, huh? Damn. I kinda wish they would've, they've been kinda cool. Alright, let's get out of here. I wanna get rid of this guy here. Can't see anything, dude. It's so dark. All right, I think we can. Can't wait yet. I'm still. I know it's dark for you guys. I'm sorry. It's just this fell out mod is crazy. We can't do anything until these guys are. This guy's dead. All right, we should be good now. Let's go ahead and loot him. God, it's so dark. <laughs> um, right, let's go to Megaton. Why did it say we can't go? We've already been here, but it's saying that... Whatever, I don't even care. We're probably never going to come back here, so... It is what it is. Alright, let's go to the house. We haven't been to our house in, in a good minute. I want to drop off all these uh, bobbleheads, too, and sleep. Stuff using stim pack. Alright, let's go ahead and sleep it off. We'll probably sleep till morning. Only a couple hours, actually. We might cancel at 6.52, just so we have that extra couple minutes. Alright, let's go ahead and activate it. Ooh, we actually have a decent amount of bobbleheads. I don't think we had that many. Alright. Alright guys, I think we're gonna end this right here. We did get the T-51. I told you that's what we're gonna do this episode. And that's what we did. Alright, a lot of cuts, I know. But, uh... I had to figure out where I was going and do things. So if you guys enjoyed it, make sure you guys do the YouTube thing. Like, comment, subscribe, and show your friends. As always, guys, I'm Mr. Johnny. And I'll be seeing you guys in the next episode of Fallout 3. Next Fall, uh, Fallout 3 episode, we're gonna be definitely checking out Vault 87, I think, is where we gotta go. So, yeah. See you guys soon. Bye. Perfect.